We're joined today by Brian Split with AgMarket.net. Brian, let's talk about this market uh, reaction that we're seeing. I'm going to call it a reaction. A lot of it based off of what's been going on down in the Gulf with the impacts of the hurricane here. What's your read of what's going on? Well, Clinton, I think one of the main things that uh, the market's showing us, not only from a flat price perspective, and so we are seeing uh, corn, soybeans, and wheat under pressure, uh, flat price, these corn, uh, you know, took out last couple weeks lows. Uh, we've got November soybeans testing last week's lows, but uh, the spreads are also uh, trading very negative. And so what I mean by that is when you think about two weeks ago, November soybeans were trading about 15 cents above the July of 22 contract. Uh, it is now currently 20 under. So the market has uh, not only, I think, gotten to the idea that the crop's gotten a little bit bigger, but we're also seeing concern about the uh, ability to export out of the Gulf and how long it might take to bring everything back online. Now, I think they'll probably overdo it. Uh, this is probably an opportunity for uh, some bull spreading in the market right now. We are advising uh, producers roll December corn hedges to March at this point. But uh, it's very evident in the spreads that uh, this, is, this is more than just a flat price reaction. Yeah, and obviously an important port for a lot of our product to go out of. Uh, and we're getting to that time of year where these export sales are about ready to pick up pace. They are, and so I, I do believe that's probably one of the components of why uh, these uh, ports will not be down as long as what some are advertising. And it's probably one of those things where, you know, you, maybe you say, hey, it'll take us four weeks, and then you're going to shoot for two and uh, under promise and over deliver. But I think the time of the year also, we are getting that point where we're gonna have a fresh crop available and the exporters wanna be able to get out of the country quickly. Yeah, it is a dynamic time of year, definitely. Sure appreciate the insight as always. Thank you for being here, Brian. We'll be back with more Ag Day coming up in just a minute. To contact Brian Split at Ag Market, call 844-4-AG-MARKET or visit their website at www.agmarket.net.